All right, in this video, I want to make an attempt to improve upon this system. So that way, when we turn left, for example, I want the gun to lag a little bit behind. So that way, our where we're aiming is not always in the dead center. I want it to have a little bit of kind of sway movement to it. So what we're going to do is we're going to create another. Let's do it with the rotation. Let's copy the U property. Let's create an F vector. Let's call it turn location instead. Let's set that to uh, pretty much as, well, that'll be zeroed out vector by default anyways. So let's head down to rotate with rotation. And let's think. So what we want to do is we have that all set up for rotation. Let's try to figure it out. We want to use the same values for the yaw and roll to offset the location. So out of curiosity, I'm just going to try to do turn location dot, let's see, X I think is left to right. Let's look. So we click on that. We click on our mesh. Okay, so X is forward and back. I Wait, is it? I think it was actually backwards last time. So X, I think, is actually going to be left to right. We'll see. So we'll do dot X plus sequels yaw. Or turn rotation dot yaw. And then turn location dot Z plus equals turn rotation dot roll. Let's give that a try. Let's close it down and relaunch. So this should automatically interpolate for us as well, since we're going by an interpolated rotator. At least that's what I'm hoping. So let's see what happens. We just should be able to hook it up into this node here. So we'll expose that as a pin. Add to existing for the translation. And do turn location. Plug it in. And let's see. Okay, so there is a slight problem with it. Kind of an interesting result. Let's shoot. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> so. Let's see here. Let's print out these values. So I have a log up here. No, I do not. So you read log. We're going to print out the X. Uh, X. Set F, turn location dot X. So for some reason, this is going to stay kind of static. It's not going to be reverting back. So it's just going to increase and increase and increase. Why is it increasing so bad? We do have it set to, uh, yeah, add to existing. So why is it increasing so bad? Let's print out our turn rotation dot y'all and see what that prints out. So that's going back pretty much to zero as well. Ah, yes, that's why, because we're doing plus equals. We want to just set it. That was my fault there. So instead of it constantly increasing, we'll go through and decrease back. Now, as you can see, it's moving the whole gun around like so. It's kind of got a little bit of lag behind. However, in my opinion, for up and down, we want to lower it just a tiny bit, but left to right, we probably want to cut it down by about half. So turn location.x. Actually, let's see if it, the clamping still kind of works. So yeah, so it hits a max value. So we're going to drop that down by half. So divided by 2. And then this is going to be divided by 1 point... Let's do 1.5 for the Z. So that should cut down the left to right a good bit and the up and down just a little. So up and down still has some roll to it, which seems a little odd to me. So I want to cut down the left to right a little bit more. So here, let's do divide by 4 and see how that looks. That, I think, is actually not half bad. 
Yeah, I kind of like that. So that's how we're going to leave it. So we can comment you out. And I'd say that's actually pretty good. I like it. So that's going to be all for this video. We now have a lot of us, a lot of the stuff with the sway pretty much done. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. And I'll see you in the next video. If you like what I'm doing and you want to help support me, you can find a link to my Patreon down in the description below, where I have a Team Deathmatch series just for Patreons, as well as you get early access to nearly all of my videos, such as this one. If you have any questions or anything like that, feel free to join my Discord that's also linked down below, and I'll try to help you out. So, I'll see you in the next video.